You are watching Figure TV, inspired to inspire. A very good day to you, our dear viewer of Figure TV Home Documentaries. This is David Livingston Eseru bringing to you yet another episode of the Figure TV Home Documentaries. This time coming with some good news. I hope you remember the videos of women fetching water from open wells, sharing water sources with wild animals and livestock. If you really do remember those videos, of course we captured Oluroi, we captured uh, Ogiriai, we captured uh, uh, Madoch, we captured uh, Oluroi. Those four villages have been in a very, very sorry state as far as safe and clean water is concerned. So today I come with some good news, the hope for these villages that there is something coming up there is something coming up to save them from the dirty water save them from the diseases that they have been suffering from of course we are talking about the arrival of tonda foundation together with korean hope foundation to save these people so i believe you will enjoy and like this video that we are going to bring to you right now just Keep watching and see what is happening. See the hope that these villages have and we move forward. For years, some villages of Ngora district, to mention but a few, Oluroi, Otete no Siru, Madoch and Ogiriai villages have been crying out for help as we witnessed in our earlier water crisis videos last year. <laughs> Alomutengabwe <laughs> A kwangusa yoka kipi enwe riti enwe maseta kine ya ituku. But now there is finally an answer to their prayers. Water shortage. Clean water. Clean and safe water. There is a, a shortage. And mainly for the other belt bordering the, the lake. There is a huge shortage of water. And even most of the areas. Like the area that we identified since the creation, since God created the, the world, these areas have not had it, uh, any more. But we are happy that our friends have responded to our call. We don't have water. We are all parents, I know, in this room, and we have been going to those schools. Whenever I move across the district, I keep standing and looking at these children struggling for water. Yesterday I came in around lunchtime, chair, and if you move around yourself, you have been seeing around lunchtime, children are lining at some boreholes. Some of the boreholes are actually community boreholes, not even school boreholes. So you just see uniforms lining up to take water for lunch. So we are very grateful to this organization that you are not only giving us water, but you are also giving us a meal for some of our children because the parents are not offering food to these children thanks to the efforts of the local leaders including the area councillors local council one and two leaders and the support of the loc5 odongo mike lasio also known as the penesi we are able to shine a light on the pressing water challenges in oluroi otete no siru and ogiriai villages known to be severely affected by the water crisis Additionally, a Kate in Mukura sub-county is also a beneficiary, though not in our original coverage. Tonda Foundation, with the funding from the Korean Hope Foundation, is stepping in to provide safe and clean water for these communities. We must thank Figure TV for exposing the plight of the people of Mora district. I came across the video that mentioned about the plight of the people of Mora. They don't have water, it is a water stressed area. And uh, upon that, I was able to contact our 
friends in Korea, our friends Korea Hope Foundation, and that is when they were able to come around to come and support, give a hand to Mora District, and we are ho hopeful that we are going to put three water projects here, beginning around July. We must thank Figa TV for looking out for these areas that are really doing bad in the community. The villages of Oluroi, Osiru, and Akate. That is in Mukura, sub-county, and Oteten. That is all in Mora district. The beneficiaries of these mega projects are overwhelmed with joy and are grateful to Tonda Foundation, local and district leaders, and the Korean Hope Foundation for coming to their rescue. Be having them here. I want to say thank you so much to the chairman. And on the same note, as a leader for the community of Oluroi, Oluroi particularly, some of us must have watched or seen a documentary concerning Oluroi community. This is a community which has been surviving on water from the swamps, to be honest. And we are really profoundly humbled that at last their lives are going to change by having now clean water as a, as a support from, from Tonda Foundation. I'm very grateful to get the partners available in the district so that they can help us in the area. The area in question is the hotel 10 or zero, or where I come from. It has taken long from the time, a time when I was not born. There has not been existing borehole which has helped to the area for a long time. But I think uh, Tona identified the area with the, the chairman. I want to thank the chairman very much because he gave us a priority that you will get water. The Aya Lama is a Polong Nui Ale Christi, an age because in five, Odongo last year, so mine were jog, were jog, coca. Is some of the Takirunga rain. A Yalamango, a Tenelo, a Pugana, a Jaito Mocholong, a Telecart, no, a district long or a Kedaleba, and Wapedori, a Chamunu, a boy scot, the Capo Teten, Capo Dopot, my boy, Shone Munara, and Chut, no, while a Kipi. So, Ijay Sarang, Nada Kanewa, and Homi, a Losakirunga, and Gas Yalamiki, and I did a carity, honorable by my call. Alsa <laughs> Water system that is going to be established in these villages will be pumped and distributed by a solar powered system which will make access to water much easier. So I'm very grateful and I wanted to let you people know that the surveying has been done and we have got a point where we are going to drill for you people water. So just stay assured that it is not far from today. And I want to assure you that after drilling this water, we are going to connect the solar pumping system and we are going to connect a big tank. And after that, all households are going to get taps from this water. So let people stay calm and let them know that this project has come and it is going to help everyone in Mora. Meanwhile, Ogiriai village has as well been supported by the Ministry of Water with a solar powered water system. Kipi, <laughs> Uh, are you going to a pugan? Adumuni, you are production well. Are you going to be able to do it? Anuda, I am not going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. 
Ne sai boy city na rai water stress. Ti ona do na keep noi. E boy city na keep noi. Thank you for watching. Together we can make a difference. Figa TV inspired to inspire. And I am David Livingston Eseru. Please remember to subscribe, like and share the video for the good of the societies and for the good of Figure TV Home Documentary as your like, your subscription matters a lot to us. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.